Throughout their placement, the trainees are finding out firsthand just how hard the job can be sometimes. So when they get a rare day off, they make the most of it by visiting family and friends. Steph's off to see her granddad. I'm driving because it's um, chicken down. Instead of living in halls, Steph chose to stay at home, so her grandparents are close by. Yeah, they live about two minutes walk away from me. When I was little, they lived opposite me, so I'm very close to them. It was Steph's granddad who suggested this career, but he didn't think she'd be out with the armed police so soon. Right, how'd you get on with him? I was, like, quite nervous because I was like, oh, me and Sam going to have to get in the back of the ambulance with this man? And he'd, like, cut all his neck, cut all his wrists, um, so much... Sam's a woman? Yeah. Sam's a woman? Yeah. yeah. Two, like, young women, like, in the back yeah. with this, this big man that had, like, slit his wrists, slit his neck. And he was, like, one of the nicest patients I'd had, like, so far. He was just so polite to me. It was just odd. I felt kind of guilty that I'd been, like, nervous of him and then... After meeting him, I was like, oh, OK, he was really nice to me. Like, there's no reason for me to be nervous of him. Well, all the signs were should, should have made you frightened. <laughs> yeah. Policemen with guns and things like that. Exactly. But I think it was all a bit like... what was said was more frightening than what he'd actually done. <laughs> See you later. Yeah, keep us informed, then, Steph. Will do.